To take the group self-assessment, you're going to go ahead and fill out your name and your email address and what your role is, department uh, you're located in, uh, and if this is the first time taking the assessment, and you're going to go ahead and click continue. The other thing that you're going to want to have open is you're going to want to have a second window of the group service open. So um, in this case, in order to open, uh, log into my Blake Google Groups, I'm going to select the link with, by holding the command key down, the control key down, and open tab. This will allow me to uh, go back and forth between the assessment that I answer and the group service. So I can switch back and forth between the two as I start to answer questions. And as I have any difficulty um, with any of the questions, for example, I can access Google Groups, I can always click the resource section, which will open a new tab. And in this case, it looks like a support article on how to access and uh, switch to the new view groups. And I can go ahead then and start playing the movie below. I would go ahead and continue on um, until I finished uh, answering all the questions. So yes, I understand the difference. Yes, I understand how they work. No, I'm not sure about the difference. Yes, I can access. No, I can't. So on and so forth until eventually, as I scroll all the way down um, the assessment, I click continue until I finally reach the submit button. At that point, I will finish the assessment. You want to keep in mind that you need to make sure that you leave your computer open and this window available in order to finish the assessment in one sitting. So make sure you plan uh, for enough time to uh, finish the work. Good luck.